Chief Justice did not relate to negating the provisions of the law. What I'm quoting to you is not an administrative directive. Before that circular takes effect in law, it, it must at least be a practice direction. It must be a practice direction. You do not effect amendments of the law or enforcement of the law by an administrative circular. To get that straight, in any event, I have just quoted the procedure that you must follow. And that trial court judge in the magistrate court, sorry, no, the magistrate court judge, court, uh, magistrate judge, did not either know that the provisions that I have just mentioned, 204, 203, 180, and 184, bind the prosecution to bring the accused person before her. And then at that stage, what she does is that if there is even the smallest scintilla of evidence, then she binds the accused over for trial at the High Court, for the trial on indictment. That is the procedure. So there was nothing wrong. Now, let's look at, uh, I think Abraham has, sorry, yeah, Abraham has spoken very well about the... You mean Mr. Maliba? Yeah, Mr. Maliba. Is it, your name's sake. <laughs> <laughs> He's spoken very well about... And he looks like me. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> He's spoken very well about what happened, what happened um, in the first court, that is the Human Rights Court. Yeah. Yes, sir. Now, you see, what you they... Have, you have two minutes. To what they did was... As Abraham read from Act 244, there are certain procedures that have to be undergone. The first is you, ask, you make an order, an order for the uh, prosecution to, but at that stage there wasn't any prosecution. In fact, the MPPs, they snuck there quietly. They are complaining about the fact that we didn't give them information about, or the attorney general didn't give them information about going to the second court. And then we were trying to pull a fast one behind their back and get them remanded. Ask them. Did they give us information about going to the Human Rights Court? When you say they I wrote a letter. That's why I corrected myself. <laughs> please. They wrote a letter <laughs> to the Chief Justice, and that is why now we are looking at the role of the Chief Justice in all this. They have brought her squarely into the picture because they wrote a letter to the Chief Justice asking for an expeditious hearing of the matter. And that is how the role of the Chief Justice now is being looked at. They went to that court on an ex parte application without notice to the Attorney General. Mr. Ikuotu and his, his group went there on their own and made those arguments for which the judge uh, ordered that. Not bail. He did not make an order for bail because you cannot 